Do, do, do. Close that. Turn that off. Uh, do, do, do. Oh wait, area Firefox open. There we go. Copy this. Uh, Twitter. Okay. Uh, not roller coaster tycoon. A bit of the Oregon Trail, and then we'll play some sim theme park. Okay, there it goes. And, whoops, I should make that actual screen. Instead of like four different layered windows. There we go. And then chat, and then hello! There we go. Now that's all up and everyone is happy, maybe. Depending on how much you really like Sim Theme Park. Which I have dug out of my drawer. And... I think I might have lost the instruction booklet, too. Which is going to be a bit of an issue, because I don't know how to play this. Uh, it's got buttons on the back. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll figure it out as we go along. But anyway, let me load up the Oregon Trail, because that always takes a long time to get going. Uh, do, 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 do. There it is. Ooh. Oh, wait, I gotta bring the chat up, don't I? The pop-out chat versus the IRC chat. So you can all change your colors and put Kappa in the chat. Gotta get priorities straight. Okay, so... Do, do, do. This has to go at about the right height. Just try to line that up. Yeah, that's close. And bring it down to about there, and then shrink it to about that much. Maybe. Maybe. Turn the volume down a little bit on my end, so it doesn't echo too terribly much. All right, file screen region. Uh, do, 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 do. In case you've ever wondered, I think this game runs at like 640 by 440. Kind of a weird resolution, but oh well, that's what it is. Alright, that works, like that. Chat goes on one side, little thing to tell people to change colors goes on the other side. Also, my chat room is kind of broken. Uh, I don't know what happened to it. It looks like this. Oh. Actually, it doesn't look white, it had a bunch of other colors on it. Oh no, stop responding. Why? Okay, well, that's not working out. I can just kind of put this over here and pretend. What happened to you, chat room? Firefox is not responding. Why? I had more tabs open. I lost all of them. Also, there's apparently a Twitch program for Twitch TV hidden gems. Makes you unique. Do you sing while you play? No. Are you an exceptional speedrunner? No. Are you outrageously funny? Not really. However, I do play old edutainment games. And quite badly at that. That means that's totally the hippest thing in cool. Also, why do I have a tab on this? There's no other windows open, right? Yeah, I, there aren't. Huh. Oh well, whatever. Uh, just line it up with another part. And move that down. Uh, I'm sure Chrome is fine, and I'm sure on a technical level, Chrome is probably a better browser. But I've used Firefox for the longest time, ever since I found out that it had tabs. Stopped using Internet Explorer and went to this. And I just never had a reason to change. It's kind of like a Swiss army knife of browsers that just have so many add-ons on the thing. Uh, does that fit? 
That fits. There we go. And I just need to put the little rules at the bottom. As the screen melts away. Uh, to do, do, do Microsoft Word. And text box. Text box. Come on, there we go. Nope, no, I'm gonna box on a box. Create your drawing here. I've never used that. There it is. Oh, now you can see. You can join in on the Microsoft Word action. Check out all my cool fonts like TI-83 PC and Calligrapher and all these other ones and that, which I can't read. Denmark looks... I don't know what that has to do with Denmark at all. Uh, Hebrew? I don't know where these even came from. Fairly sure they're not standard fonts. Justice font. City of Council, matter of fact. Like, what, what are these? Where do they come from? I'm sure somebody's probably shouting out the answer in the chat. Oh, finally, I've got TI-73 font, TI-83 font, 83, 83 plus, 86, 89, 92. Times New Roman, Wingdings, Zap F, Humnist BT. Oh well. Ariel it is. Oh, that's right, there's a chat there. Uh do do do. Text box, format, please fill color in black. And I'll make it like twenty because I guess that works. Red. Yeah, put some dots. Red, blue, green, or pink. Dot dot dot. And red ought to be red. Nope, oh, that's the highlighter. That's the font. Red is red, blue is... kind of blue, green is... also green. That's blue-green, though. That's green. Or... pink. Okay. And just stash that at the bottom, so no one ever needs to know. I do love my ellipses, yes indeed. Let me slide this over. I need two chats up at once. Uh, add title. Do, 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 do. Not Calibri. I need Ariel. Change your color, that's what it is, in the chat to dot dot dot. But I finally dug Sim Theme Park out of my drawer in my desk, and uh, all I remember about the game is not liking it. Because I really liked uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon growing up, but never really liked Sim Theme Park. And I'm not quite sure why or what the difference is, but... wondering. So I also haven't played it in probably right about a decade or so. So don't expect me to know what I'm doing. Oh wait, not that. That's not what I need. I need another title. doesn't even fit. Hmm. You know, I could just put all these words across one line. Which, I guess I don't need all of the ellipses then, but... It's a very pensive description, I guess. <laughs> I don't know why. This looks really dumb now. 
having all the ellipses, but having everything on one line. Oh, so that's Calibri, that's why it doesn't work. There we go. There. Well, it's not lined up. Now it is. Okay, well, it sort of works, but not especially very well. Okay, so that's all there. Um, hmm. That does look really silly. It's artistic. Okay, so I'm gonna put this down there. The chat's up there, right? Right. Yes, it is. Hello. So, I should play IB. I don't know what that is. Um, where's my phone? There it is. I'll move it away from Mike. Talk louder or lower the game. Somebody just told me to turn the game up. There. I turned the game down again. Anyway going to play some Oregon Trail and then some Sim Theme Park, which I've finally pulled out the disc for. And, uh, I'm sure you guys know the drill for this, but again, change your color in the chat to either red, blue, green, or pink to, uh, join a wagon party of that color. IB is apparently a free game and amazing. Get a timer and start speed running the Oregon Trail. I can get the world record. <laughs> after this, after this playthrough, I will speed run the Oregon Trail. Let me just find like a free JavaScript timer or something. Online timer. Does this work? I just wanted to start. Is that a thing? Oh, is this a countdown thing? I need a count up thing. Timer stopwatch. That's not what I want at all. Um. Oh god, I should. T <laughs> I should totally set up W split with all the little landmarks on it. That would be great. In fact, I think I'll do that this time. Um. Or next time. put in all the rivers, all the little towns, all the landmarks. It'll be fantastic. And by that I mean totally pointless. And I'm down for that. <laughs> yes, get some splits for the Oregon Trail. This, documents, I don't even know where this is going to go. Website, sure. My random website folder. Uh, yeah, extract that there. I don't know... Um, what all the different things are, to be honest, so... As I go through the uh, the Oregon Trail, I'm going to have to make a note of uh, all the different locations and write them all down. And then we can have some speedrun Oregon Trail, and it could be like the hip new thing. You know, it's, it's like your dad trying to rap. He's trying to remain relevant here in this crazy world, which now favors people playing games well instead of playing games crappily, which is kind of what I am really capable of doing. So anyway, here is the Oregon Trail. Again, change your color in the chat to either red, green, or pink. And, uh, off Welcome we go! To the Oregon Trail. Again. You're about to begin a great adventure, traveling the Oregon Trail across the rugged landscape of... Yeah, I'm kind of hoping it becomes a thing, because then you could have away. random Japanese we'll people beat me at the Oregon Trail. Somebody needs to do a, uh, tool-assisted speed to run of the Oregon Trail. Before you set off on anyway, we all know the drill here. So, Tim, Team Red, Team Blue, whoops, there's an E there. Team Green, Team Tram Pink. I don't know why I keep spelling tram. Alright. Also, um, when somebody does a speed run, do they start the timer after they put their name in, or once they hit start on the file that they just made. 
because I'm not sure if I would have to make like all the names A or something really fast. I guess this can start the precedent. Alright, well, when do you want to leave? August is kind of a bad idea. March, April, April, blue is not a month, but thanks for playing. April, April does. Ten oxen, five sets clothing, ten, one, 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 four hundred, five hundred, even. Alright, and off we go. No, dead of winter is kind of a bad idea. Everyone dies. Alright, also, I'm going to have to update this little thing with the various places on the trail so I can do a speed run of it. Quote, unquote. So, I've never used this before, by the way. Uh, segment. What's the first thing? Kansas River. Alright. That's a good start. And off we go! And, uh, we made it, I guess. <laughs> There's really not much to say about the first river. It's like, hey, we, we didn't die. Woohoo. And we didn't die on the river, either. And I need to add a new thing to this. Big Blue River. Save. No, I, I'm making the splits for the uh, upcoming run. Alright, Big Blue River, 6.2 feet deep. That's taller than me, so we probably shouldn't ford that. Now, you can actually have a different time to get to the first river, depending on uh, how many oxen you have, how many error messages pop up probably things in this you could do to make it run faster. Oh, maybe not. Oh, no. Alright. You can change your simulation speed. We can make it slow. So you can just sit here all day and watch the oxen. This is still the same day, by the way. Now they just take a long, long time. Oh, God. <laughs> This is terrible. This is the real grueling pace. It's been two days. Alright, just put that back on fast. And Team Pink was bitten by a snake. I'm sorry, Tram Pink. And I need to put Fort Carney in here. Fort Carner. Carney. Who suggested this? To, uh, to attempt a speed run of this game. Because that was a terrible idea, and yet it's, it's strangely compelling. Because that animal bit somebody in the party, we need to shoot other animals. Show nature who's boss. Because that buffalo totally had something to do with that snake. You know, if there's no record for this game, do I just get it by default? Tram Pink is well again. Independence rocks skip. Oh, jeez. Broken wagon axle, do you want to fix it? Yes, please. And we couldn't. Go figure. Submit it to speedruns live. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I totally should. Have them fly me down to uh, awesome games done quick, and this will be my bit. And welcome to Chimney Rock. I have to add this on here. And save. And go. 
The thing is that this isn't the DOS version. Or is it? Oh no, that's Oregon Trail Deluxe. That is actually the same version of this game, but on DOS. Alright, I thought you were referring to another one. Okay. Um... I don't know. It's not technically the same. It's really similar, but I don't know if you can call that the same game. Yeah, we do have the robot that plays this game, which I guess you can call a, uh, a tool-assisted speedrun for the Oregon Trail. Here lies Tim... The, oh. <laughs> this is from last night, it's kinda hard to read. The 43 bucks is behind the gravestone for when the thief robbed us and we had no money. Uh, my version is... 1.2 for Windows. The CD is pink, and it has yellow lettering, and uh, that's about all I know. You can probably find a link on eBay to buy it. Start up the burgeoning Oregon Trail speedrun community. You believe in me, I'm so sorry. Do 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 do. This is the only version of the Oregon Trail I've ever played. This is the one my friends had. This is the one that I had. We didn't have this in school or anything, because I guess they realized there's really nothing they're going to learn from playing this. You have a version that's on three discs. What could you possibly have in the Oregon Trail on three discs? Aside from maybe more buffalo when you're hunting things. All the new Oregon Trail versions are entirely too cutesy. It's gotta be more realistic and gritty. And shooting thousands of pounds of meat and then being robbed of money you don't have while the wagon catches fire and you die of broken snake bite. Also, there's nothing here to shoot. Nothing at all. <laughs> Alright, fine. We're just gonna starve. And that's Independence Rock, so I have to put that up on here. And did I spell that wrong? I-N-D-E-P-E-N-D-E-N-C. -E 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 nope, that's right. Alright. Need to shoot more things. I feel like even the idea of speedrunning this game is pretty much just how fast, how fast, how fast you can mash buttons. You know, when you're trading, when you're uh, going through the little dialogue things. But you know, gotta do it anyway. Why not? Also, something like this could totally sink a run when there are no buffalo to shoot. Ah. There. Totally worth it. Um. <laughs> Great. Two pounds of meat. That works. Everyone is still in fair health, which means you can afford to not eat for a day or two. Alright, let's try to hunt again. Is there anything here? No! No, there isn't. Which means we're doomed. Pretty much. Shoot the grass. Shoot the rock. I can't shoot the rock, it's apparently too close. Ah. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that game. And now we get lost. But at least we have food. Heavy fog. Spoilage. 
That's exactly what we need. And bad water, you know, just, just rub it all in. Everyone is still alive, though. Team Pink was bitten by a snake, but survived. Uh, South Pass, save. Alright. No grass. South Pass, where there is grass. Also, I don't know what it is with this game and making all the mountains hot pink, but... That's kind of what all of the colors are. And now Team Green is suffering from exhaustion. Which... I don't know, in this picture, that's Team Green, that's Team Pink. And Team Pink is... I don't know, Team Green is trying to sabotage Team Pink? I don't know. Kind of difficult to tell. Also, no grass! Aside from this grass. And that deer. Which is now dead. And that thing. And that deer. Why am I shooting all these deer? That's probably enough. 309 pounds. Alright. Bad water. Happy June 2nd. June 3rd. No water. Oh, wait. I was supposed to rest for you guys. <laughs> oh, no. Team Green was so exhausted their arm broke in half. Well, that's a bit of an issue. Here's one day. Is your arm fixed? Here. Here's another day. Is your arm fixed? One more. There we found fruit. That could be your new arm. And now we have no water. Well, that's about all I can do for you. I'm not a doctor, only a teacher. And now we're at the Green River. Let me just add that onto this. Okay. Uh, 40 feet deep, 400 feet across. I would love to take a ferry, but it costs $5, and we don't have enough money. So now we have to caulk it. And see what happens. Oh, well that happens. Oh, well that happens. Everyone died, and 10 pounds of food. Hmm. <laughs> I need to get the rest of the locations, though. I'm only up to here. I need more. How am I supposed to get them all now? Is there a list? Hmm. It'd be nice if there were a list of them in here. Although I'm fairly certain there aren't. Is it this? No. What's this? It's a help file. Why can't I get help from this program? Because it's the Oregon Trail and it wants you to die. Alright, let me see if I can pull up all of the locations in order. And let me just start putting in the ones that I already have. So maybe it'll help pull up a list. The Mormon Trail. And there's a link for my site. I wonder if Wikipedia has all of the same things. Oh. No, that's educational. That's not what I'm looking for. Kansas River, Big Blue River, Fort Kearney. Yeah, that's that's not very helpful. Fort Laramie. Oh, Fort Laramie. Independence Rock. I spelled that wrong. Uh. Hmm. I can't tell. Oh wait, this might be. This might be right. Uh. No, it isn't. I should check game FAQs. Are there? Entries for this game and game FAQs? 
This looks kind of right. Okay. So, Kansas River Crossing, which is the first one. Then Big Blue, which is the second. Then, Easy E is sick with typhoid fever. Does this have Fort Kearney? Alright. Then Chimney Rock, so it's still in the right order. Then Fort Laramie. Then Independence Rock. Then South Pass. Then Green River Crossing. Then... What else? Do 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 do. Soda Springs, then Fort Hall. Okay. Snake River Crossing, Fort Boise. I guess. And then the Grand Ronde, and then the Dells. Dallies. And I think that might be it. And the only issue is that I don't see all the things here. Oh, there they are. So there, <laughs> we could technically have uh, a speed run of this game. Check my PMs. Okay. Don't forget done. Oh, yeah. I'm new to this whole playing games well thing. Be quite pleased with that. I think Wait, who's talking? No, I can't have your content on my stream or else I get banned. Ah. There we go. Day has been saved. Check my messages. Oh, wait, they mean IRC messages. There we go. So there is a game FAQs thing for this. Do, 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 do. Okay, do I have all these? No, wait, hang on. The game script. Alright, instead of done, I should probably put the... Willamette Valley. Is it Willamette Valley? I don't know. There. Okay, do I have all of these? Uh, I don't need the first one. Yes, 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 yes. Fort Bridger? Oh, that's optional. You don't need that one. Uh, green, soda, right, all right. Fort Walla Walla is optional. The Dalles and Walla. Okay, good. So that is all of them. And, uh... <laughs> uh, I don't know when to call it to say that it starts. Um, should it start after we pick names, or after we buy things, like once I hit buy and the game begins, is that when I should say it starts, or should typing in after you buy? Okay, once you hit buy, then it starts. I think that kind of works, because at this point it's kind of like how fast can you type in numbers and then hit like tab every time. Which, I feel, kind of throws things off. Okay, well, I've never used this before, ever, so I don't actually know what you have to do to make it work. Uh, what's the hotkey for this? How about F12? How does this actually work? Uh... Hmm. Buying things is part of the game. Okay, turn this on. Now I need to make this... Go, do something. None? F12. There we go. Reset. That seems like an important one. That'll be F11. And it goes to the next one automatically, right? Or do I have to make that its own thing? Like, if I say start and make a split, it'll just move on. I won't have to go to the next segment? I'm assuming I've never used this. It goes automatically. Okay, that sounds right. And save. So if I were to hit F12, it would do nothing. All right, that's a great start. F11 is the reset button. Uh, how does this go? Global hotkeys enabled. 
I need to bind stop. Alright, that'll be F10. Set. F12 should make it start, but it isn't. Um... Hmm. I forgot to hit save. No, it's there. Unless I need to bind all of these. Yeah, you're probably right. Probably shouldn't have the split key be right next to the reset one. Maybe I'll just make it something like control. That shouldn't screw anything up. Control. Yes. Pause can be... I don't know. Use number page? I don't even know where that is on this keyboard. Oh. It's on the other side. Uh, pause can be alt, I guess, because that's next to it. Menu? Alright. Uh, reset. I'll just make enter on the number pad, because that's on the other side of the keyboard, and I'm probably not going to hit that accidentally. Now, does this go? There it goes. Which is reset. Enter. Wow, I feel so professional. Oh, man. Can I make it do a little decimal seconds? Or is that not a thing? Uh, do, 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 do. I wish it could. I probably can figure out that. Right. Show decimal separator, yes please. Does that work? No, it doesn't. Eh, whatever. It works. So, I... <laughs> somebody suggested this, and it's kind of a joke, but at the same time, I... I sort of feel like I have to do it. So... Uh, I'm gonna get rid of the random little bits of junk at the bottom. We need accuracy to nine decimals. I think we do. So, now I have to figure out how I can put the chat here. And have the timer. Um, maybe... That's a good height. And how big is a timer? This is such a terrible thing. Alright, there we go. So the chat's a little bit too big. Nah, I gotta leave the chat. Why not? That's a little bit too short, though. And that looks okay. There, this is not a terrible idea at all. <laughs> oh dear, so it's control to go and enter to reset. Alright. I just need to figure out when I should start counting the timer. Ouch. Um, should it be... Should it be... Okay, once you select where to leave, so I'm gonna have to figure out... I have to go to, like... Let's see, I've gotta be able to put in, like, 10... 5, 10, 1, 1, 1, and 500... Really fast. Okay, so... <laughs> after you buy stuff... After clicking buy... Okay, after clicking buy works for me. It's easier. Uh, let me just put something else on Twitter because I'm breaking new ground by doing something exceptionally stupid. Um, oh, no, wait, stop. <laughs> uh, no, we'll do the uh, Sim Theme Park after this, after a couple runs of this. Oh, I'm trying to hit control V and it's activating the splits. <laughs> I could have thought that through a little bit better. 
There we go. I'll just right click it then. Enter. Oh no, you're kidding. I can't hit enter because I have enter bound to that. Oh wow. <laughs> you can tell I'm kind of new at this. Uh so reset is no longer return. How about make it the plus key, which is right on top of the enter key. The add key. There we go. Genius. Okay, well, I've never done this before and may never do it again, but we need to find out if this is even a viable thing. So I guess we can have teams in here. Uh, because the length of your name doesn't really matter on this. So Team Red, Team Blue, Team Green, and Team... Team Pink. Alright, and it's Control to start, and that to res restart. No, that's not it. <laughs> uh, hmm. Well, that's not stopping it, is it? Hmm. Oh, the reset key got unbound somehow. There we go. There. Alright, and teacher. You know, if this is a speed run, there's no reason not to pick or uh, not to pick banker. Now that I think about it. Because if you want to do this as fast as possible, picking teacher is the crappiest class. If you do banker, you can just buy as many oxen as you want in the beginning and go really fast. So, might as well just do that. And April, and 20, and... I can just buy everything, can't I? Wow, I, I totally can. <laughs> I can buy everything. Everything. Every single thing. I... I'm not used to that at all. Alright, once I hit buy, it starts, so... And I even have money to take the, uh, ferry. Alright, and... Go! The wagon is overloaded. I don't know if that makes it go slow. It probably does. Oh, there we go. Oh god, what? How's everything breaking? It's... <laughs> this is terrible. Wow. Oh, wait. It's not space, it's control. Oh, screw it. Alright, hang on. Just Time for my first ever reset. Wait, what's the... Does exit do that? Or is that close game? Alright, ignore that. It's a learning experience. Okay, banker, April, 20 oxen, 5, 10, 1, 1, 1, and 500. There. And... Go. And grueling pace, I guess. Oh, I shouldn't have taken the ferry. I have to wait three days. I think grueling is going to get us all killed. Don't sink. Okay. It's still good. You know, Doctor would probably work better than Banker. I didn't even spend all my money, so... There's still time. Oh, Red has a broken leg. Gotta be faster in those, uh... little message boxes. Because Enter doesn't close them like I thought it would.
Well, let's go in. Whoops, no, wait. No, go back, how do I... Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, no, actually, that's okay. I didn't go ahead. And now we lost the trail, so we're doomed. And pink is dysentery. And a, a blizzard in April, apparently, is a thing. Oh, no, wait, I totally did go ahead. Whoops. Alright, I just don't hit the next one, then. Alright, pink as well again. Also, there's going to be hunting involved in this somehow. Because we're going to run out of food. Hmm. You don't have enough space in the wagon. For eight oxen, no. 500 pounds of food, but I have lots of money. Ugh, pink as the measles. No one wants to sell me food. Just a bit of a problem. $97, fine, let's go. Well, we haven't died yet, which is good. Also, I think taking the ferry is wasting too much time on this. Every time you take the ferry, it has to wait a couple of days. Hmm. Oh, fire in the wagon destroyed eight pounds of food. Terrible idea. <laughs> Am I going to submit this to the speedrun library website? I could. I guess. Blue is a fever. Now, if you change the rations, then everyone dies. Which is a problem. Although no one's actually gotten... Well, no one's died yet. Which is good. I really wish hitting enter would... go through the dialogue boxes, though. But it doesn't. Oh! No, wait, it totally does! Well, why wasn't I doing that? <laughs> oh, crap. Control, which is not enter, apparently. Red got lost. Red died. Green died. <laughs> yes, hitting enter is the new speedrunning technique for the Oregon Trail. Gotta close those dialogue boxes. is very poor. No, wait! <laughs> oh no! That's Fort Walla Walla, you don't want to go there. There's no point to going there, unless you want to spend money. Oh well. Oh, I put that split in the wrong place. <laughs> it's bad routing on that one. Yeah, I, I messed this one up. Quite badly. Well, it's like about six minutes or so. Or maybe not, actually. It's gonna be a little bit longer. That's my new goal, under six minutes. <laughs> Let's do it. Gotta cut 20 seconds. 
And I think if I pick Doctor, it'll work better. So, 623. <laughs> With the horrible, horrible score. Do I want to save? Not really. Okay, Tim, red, blue, green, pink. And Doctor. Oops, it's Pinge. Uh, April, 20 oxen, 5... Probably no boxes of anything, just one of these and 500 pounds of food. And, uh... Let's see if this works. Let's see if this goes any better. Now, I didn't want to save that just because I, um... Screwed up a couple of times in, uh, whoops, putting the splits where they ought to be. Like that time, for example. So it's 15 seconds from the Kansas River and the Big Blue River from one another. Apparently, you lost the trail. Bummer. No, you can have, um... You're not allowed to actually have fewer than five people in your party, I'm fairly sure. This is actually going pretty well is kind of sad. The one time I'm not even trying, it just works. Oh, now Red's sick. Oh, whoops. I put that in the wrong place. I'm not used to managing, like, the game and the timers and my phone's beeping itself. And... Alright. I messed up the Independence Rock one. And I got an email. Which I will read in a bit. You know, we're doing reasonably pretty well on this. Like, hardly anything bad has happened. Which is great. Also, you're right, I would have to, um... make a new file, because every time it comes up with a gravestone, that's time wasted. So we need food. We can buy that at Fort Hall, so that's okay. Well, I think this should be under six minutes at least. Maybe. Still amazed that no one died, only one person got sick. Oh, I should have traded clothing for this. Don't sink. Oh, wow. We didn't. Oh, now Pinge is sick. Oh, well. Lose nine days. Oh, God, that's painful. Green is the measles. That thief stole 12 oxen? <laughs> Why? Why would you do that? No, green died. We have 8 oxen left. That's less than half. <laughs> so much for that. It's going so well. Fort Boise had a store, but we didn't need to use it. Which is the thing. It 
was going well. Till twelve of my oxen were stolen. That's no good. Okay, this should probably be under five minutes. I don't think it takes that long to go down. I don't think the toll road... Actually, no, you might be right. The toll road, because you don't have to do the rafting bit, that might be faster. It, in fact, it's it's totally faster now that I think about it. Because this is where the bulk of the uh, time goes in the little rafting bit. So if you take the toll road, you can make it down a little bit faster. So... 5.09. Apparently. Um, I don't know if the game ends right after you get to the Dalles. Um, save the splits. How do you do that? Save as. I have no idea what I'm doing with this. Do I want to set this run as old? Or hit save as? Save as. I don't know. Oregon Trail. Save. What did that do? I don't know. Um, track best as, compare against, display settings, show attempt count. <laughs> Maybe. Set run as old, is that a thing? I don't know. I've never used this. Compare against... Just hit split now. It'll save as your best. Will it... Um, what's configure do? Anything? Do I want that? No, maybe not. Uh, I did hit save, whatever that is good for. Should this be wider, you think? Hmm. I really have no clue. It's the first time I've ever used this program, so... I did hit save. I thought I did. Yeah. Yeah, you can't really speedrun uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon because the time of the scenario is pretty much... Whatever it is. Just hit space again. Do I have to set this run as old? Whatever that means. What if I do that? Eh, nothing happens. Alright, well, I'll give it another shot. Um, nope. And Tim, red, blue, green, pink, and, uh, I have to hit split once more before it starts again. Alright, well, let me just go into Doctor. And April. And 20, and 5, and 0, and 1, and 1, and 1. Actually, I'll just do 2, just to be safe. And 500 pounds of food. And... Hmm. So if I hit split one more time, it goes? Okay. So it has to restart. And... Go! So... It's already going pretty well so far, I guess. So it says... Can I get it under five minutes? Yes, toll road this time. No more rafting. Rafting is not good for anyone, apparently. Well, still have all my oxen. They all weren't stolen like last time.
Because some things you have to hit enter on, other things you have to click. Like that. When you go to a place. So, I've got to, uh... Keep what I have to do to each... Straight in my mind. And now I'm losing time, apparently. Okay, self pass. I gotta work on my independence rock time, I guess. Or people just have to not get sick. The whole idea of this being a speedrun thing is just kind of absurd. Also, please don't sink. Alright. at Fort Hall. That's my current route, I guess. Just buy 500 pounds of food here and go. So now you never have to hunt. Lose six days. That's what happened last time, at the exact same place. And then we found a bunch of fruit, and then 12 of my oxen got stolen. Last time it was no, oh, no. <laughs> that didn't happen last time. Oh, two people died. Oh well. Bad water, impassable trail. Stop that. Oh, blue is dysentery. It was going so well. Yeah, that, that's totally the drowning strategy. You just make up so much extra time. I don't know. Somebody blew is near death, but thankfully the doctor was able to help. Oh no, it's the fort! That's not the toll! Crap. Mess that one up. Alright, so if you go to the toll road here, should make up a lot of time. Because you don't have to raft, you just get there and win. There. <laughs> oh, whoops. I hit it a little bit too early, but... Oh well, there we go. 436, apparently. For this. <laughs> I still can't believe I'm actually doing this. Such a horrible idea. Apparently, new WR is trending on Twitter. Which makes me think Sig got the record again? I don't know. Maybe he did. Do I want to save? No, I don't. Somebody told me on YouTube that the world record is 414 for the Oregon Trail, and that's for the DOS version, which I don't know how different that is in terms of how fast the game runs. Actually, I have a terrible idea. Um, let me pull that up. Let me put that in the corner of my screen. 413 is what this guy has. is... time starts now, okay. If that's what he says, that's what I'll go with. Um, 
god, I've got like no... <laughs> I've got no space at all for any of this stuff. Um, hmm. I can move this over here. And then put this down here? Yeah, that fits. Now I have to put the world record thing over in the corner. I might have to kill the chat, by the way. Gotta make room for this. Oh, that doesn't even really fit very well, does it? Alright. <laughs> this is kind of a parody of all the other speedrunners, I think. World, world, world. Now I have to hit... Alright, I have to hit, um... Oh man, how am I going to do this? I have to hit start on mine, hit the split on this, and then hit play on the YouTube thing, which I think might make the game pause, so maybe I'll slide the timer down a little bit. Alright, so I can start that a little bit earlier and see what happens. Okay, so Tim, red, blue, green, pink. Yeah, I use the Japanese version of the Oregon Trail. April 250111. You know, every single time things go wrong, it never involves wagon wheels or axles or tongues, and I'm wondering if you actually need to bring those along. But in any event, let me start that and go. Oh man, there's so much stuff just flying around on my screen, I can't keep up with it. Sinking's faster than crossing safely? What? Oh crap, I've already... <laughs> I can't keep up with all this stuff. Alright, I've messed that up. I messed up that one split because I'm paying attention to... the chat and the game and his game and... apparently the DOS version is much faster. Oh god. <laughs> Look at that animation in comparison to mine. It's running dramatically faster. I don't think we're able to really compare the two. Like, at all. Also, the uh, DOS one is animation. Which the Windows one doesn't have. Oh, go. Oh, crap. <laughs> Sometimes the game decides to just pause itself. Broken wagon axle. We fixed it. Well, that didn't happen last time. Yeah, I don't I don't think you can compare the two. Because I think the DOS one just runs way too fast. By comparison. Blizzard on April 22nd. Pink as the measles. Heavy fog. That's no good. That's pink as a broken arm. And he's already crossing the Green River. That's no good. I am losing time. A lot of time. Hmm. How's he already at Fort Hall? Oh man. Probably should have bought food. 
Oh, now we have some food. Now we have more food. You know, I'm just not even going to buy any food at Fort Hall. Forget it. I'm just going to forego the food and hope we can make it. We probably can't. Health is very poor. Well, I'm a doctor, so that's okay. How fast would the bot go? I think the bot counts as tool assisted. Hmm. Yes, fine. Oh, great. Did we all die? No, just most of us. <laughs> Three out of the five are dead. Where's he at? You have reached the Dalles already? How? I think you can compare the DOS one and the Windows one, because I've just lost. The thing is that I haven't been able to find a, um, an identical version of this up on YouTube. That is the issue. Pink was near death. Okay. Be under five min. Oh, a thief stole sixty-two dollars. Oh, well, now it's not going to be under five minutes. Yeah, maybe I'll just try one more shot after this, and uh, and uh, we can move on to Sim Theme Park. There, <laughs> that was horrible. Yeah, I don't I don't think that guy counts. Because he's got the DOS version. Um, I guess whatever my best time is on this is pretty much going to be whatever the uh time to beat is, I suppose. Which seems a little bit self centered, but I've got nothing else to go off of. Does having more oxen go faster? Yes. Substantially so. Alright, let me try to make this go a little bit better. Do I want to say no? Travel, okay. Doctor, Tim, Zeke, Anna, Emily, and Escher. Why not? Esther? Have we pronounced that? Uh, 20 is the max oxen. Yes, the game yells at you if you try to pick more. What if I pick 2,000 pounds of food? Do I go slow? Eh, maybe I'll just do 1,000. I'm not sure how much weight impacts how fast you go in this game. How does it feel to accomplish something in my life? Feels great. Man, we found an abandoned wagon. Now everything's going slowly. It's all ruined. Oh, we sunk. I don't know if that's any faster or not. I don't think it is. No, it's not. <laughs> I don't have any food either. I don't think it's going to go terribly well. Kind of feeling a reset at the moment. We have no food. Hmm. Oh, 
Although we're going really, really fast without any food. Like, really, really fast without any food. <laughs> As in, we've made up the deficit without any food. What if I just try doing this with no food? Do you think we can make it? Because it goes so much faster without food. Now we're losing time again. Is there a way to get rid of the old tombstones? Uh, yeah, I would have to delete them, and I don't remember where that is. Heavy fog, ah. I have the measles. Oh, that means everyone else is dead. Oh, wait, no, crap. <laughs> I meant to reset, but no. I hope it doesn't count those times. I probably shouldn't. Alright, I died. Uh, apparently you need food on this. Which is a, uh... Which is a new development. So now we have Tim, Charity, Zeke, Francis, and Sarah. 20 oxen... 5... Eh. How heavy could, like, 25 sets of clothing be so we never get sick? I don't think you can take only one party member. I think you need five, but I'll check. Just Tim. I wonder if it'll just put them in as blank. There's only one way to find out. Nope, it's only me, apparently. So I'm the only person on this. Which means if I hit a river and we tip, it's over. I have the measles. Day three. So if I die, the run's over, and that's it. Is that it? <laughs> One wagon axle. Totally consumes less food, though. The whole thing just kind of runs a lot faster, but, uh... It's also a gamble, because if I die, there is uh, pretty much no buffer at all. I died. So... <laughs> I, I feel like it would make it go really fast, but that is really, really risky at the same time. I'm a doctor, and I died. You'd think I would know how to uh, not die two weeks into the trail. But I'll give that another shot. It seemed kind of promising. Because we could probably use all 500 pounds of food only, which might be enough for one person. I will now travel at a more grueling pace. I don't need 25 sets of clothes for one person, but if you have more clothing, you get sick less frequently, so I figure if I just give myself that much clothing, I'll be fine. As long as we don't sink, and there is so little anything on the wagon, we'll probably be alright. I've got the measles, so... Maybe not. Maybe I'm just going to die. No, I just get lost. Bummer. It's going so well. Yeah, I'm just wearing all 25 clothes. All 25 pairs of pants, all 25 shirts, 25 socks, all at once. getting lost kind of sunk that time. Oh well. This is such a terrible idea. <laughs> All those gravestones. I gotta find a way to dump them. If you have no clothes on at all, you just pretty much die which is no good. I 
I wonder if you just hold down enter if it automatically just makes all the things go away. It might, now that I think about it. Oh, whoops. I already hit that. Uh, only issue is how do I hold enter? And, uh... I need another hand to do that. Unless I, like, weigh it down with something. Oh yeah, if you hold down enter, the uh, messages don't appear, or, uh, don't appear. See, I lost the trail, but it didn't tell me because I'm holding down the enter key. Um, do I have anything on my desk that can hold down the enter key for me? Uh, screwdriver? Ouch, I need more hands. Uh. Uh, also something heavy. What do I have? Banging my hand every time I go in here. Uh, what is heavy in my desk? Uh, can I tape it? Hmm. Oh, great, we sunk. I died. <laughs> But holding down enter seems like it would work. Uh, I just need to... How about this? Is that heavy enough? No. Hmm. That's the heaviest thing I have in my desk. Uh, not quite. How about if I stack... this cassette tape... and put a coin on top? No. It's almost there. Holding enter with the screwdriver is definitely tool assisted. Oh man, you got me. Um, it's a matter of holding down the enter key without knocking the rest of the keys. Um, how about this compass? Is that heavy enough? No. What could you hold down an enter key with? Tape the set doesn't quite work. Unless I can get like a, a script that does that. Oh, this is what I used to use to hold down keys. Here we go. A combination lock. There we go, that works. I was looking for that, okay. Name, Tim, and dump everyone else. And doctor, April 20, 25, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1. 500. And let's see if this goes. Uh, can I put this on now? Yes, sorry. Right. So I can hold that down now. And go. And I'm holding down enter. Let's see how this goes. Now I have fewer things to uh, worry about. Yes, 20 oxen at the start. You need them all, believe me. Oh no, enter! Work! Hmm. Totally holding down the enter key, though. I don't know why that still popped up. Yeah, the enter thing isn't working. Because um, I'm holding the key down, but... Um, it's still... Yeah, let me try this over. The enter thing isn't working as I thought it would. Which is a bit of a bummer. Hmm. Use a bot. Maybe I'll just have to, um... It works with everything else, just not for... River crossings. Wait, I, I've got a thought. This, I'm not going to time this one, but with the Oregon Trail, here's another dumb strategy tip thing. With the Oregon Trail, the, um, the message boxes pop up in the same place every time as long as you put them where you want them to be. So if I want, say for example, if I just want to click everything and I want the enter key to be on top of the continue button just so I can click the same space over and over. Oh, this doesn't quite fit up there, does it? Um, uh, that might be enough overlap. 
I can just put this here so I can just sit here and click this over and over. Except, okay, I need to put it in the place where I can hit the caulk button and the continue button. So, like, every time I need to click something, it's always right here. Which is what I would have to do, so I can just keep doing this. Without worrying about uh, messing anything up. So if I put this, like, here... I can just keep doing this. So, with the combination of holding down the Enter key, and just hitting this... I'm never gonna mess up. Except the ox... I wonder if the oxen thing is like a different whatever. That doesn't make any sense, does it? Um, if the oxen bubble... Yeah, that button doesn't stick there for whatever reason. Alright. Yeah, alright. So there's there's no way to move everything, then. Sometimes it moves where we want it to be. Other times it doesn't, so never mind. Ignore that. Um, is there a place where I can put the mouse that will hit OK on this... And also the caulk thing. No, there isn't, so... Hmm. Because the thing is that if you hold down the Enter key, every time you, um... you cross a river, what happens is that that bubble pops up, and you can't hit Enter on that because you already have something waiting down the Enter key, so... maybe if I just sit and click here, in this area, when it pops up, uh, you can be ready for it. Eh, let's give it a shot. Uh, let me start a new one. See what happens. And dump these guys. And April and 20... Actually, let's not do April, because those blizzards kind of get in the way. Let's do Doctor and start in May, where there shouldn't be any blizzards. Spare bits. And that. And go. Thing on the enter key. Hoping it doesn't tip over. Alright, so as long as you're ready for the thing to pop up, we should be okay. No, it's over there, so it's on the timeout button when it comes up. Oh, yeah, the enter thing isn't actually working. Uh, what I'm gonna have to do is probably just hold enter myself because it's currently being held down, but it isn't actually working. Oh well. Yeah, so much for that. Ignore that then. Let's start again. Okay, Tim, do 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 do. And Doctor, okay, and May, and 20, and 25, and 0, and 1, and 1, and 1, and 500. Actually, why don't we just do five sets of clothing? Just do that normally. I'll just hit enter myself continuously then. Heavy fog. Oh, I can't hit, uh... I need to click with the mouse and hit enter. And my split key is left control, which means I can't really do it with the hand I'm hitting enter on, so I should probably remap that to something else. My ox is sick. Oh well. Yeah, I should make the enter key something else. Um, or not the enter key, the um, split key. Let's make that, like, the right button. Alright, let me try this. This is my new idea. Oops, now I'm just TI. Okay, Doctor, uh, May, 20 oxen, 5 sets, 0, 1, 1, 1, 500, and go. Um, what is it doing? Is this not resetting? Hang on. Go. Wait. What did I do? Go? Um. Oh. Alright, 
right, so hitting left doesn't actually make that work. I need another key for that. Um, hmm. I've never used this before. Oh, wait, control? No, it was... I set that to left. Left. Set. Save. There, or right. Which isn't left. Um, Alright, let's just restart that. I'm wasting more time on this than I thought I ever would. But I feel like I have to now. Stop all the bot or uh, boxes from popping up. Oh wait, forgot to hit the thing. This sim theme, sim theme park has been canceled until we get to the run. Well, it's kind of working. I just forgot to hit it at the Kansas River. I lost the trail. Great. There goes all the progress. Five days of nothing. Oh man. <laughs> I found some wild fruit. Woohoo. probably hell to listen to. Yeah, you're probably right. I think I can more than likely hold down the enter key every time I get to a new landmark. Yeah, I, I can. A fire apparently broke out in my wagon. Also, my arm broke, but I'm holding down enter so you would never know. Oh, wait. Did I not hit that? Alright, ignore that. Let me try something. I think that actually would be how that works if you hold down enter once something comes up. Probably don't have to keep tapping it. Set the game to Oregon Trail, I should. I found some fruit, by the way. Jeez. <laughs> How? Oh, great. I lost a wagon wheel and a wagon tongue. And now I have exhaustion. And I hit the thing at the wrong time. Alright, just... Let me set the thing up on Twitch before I forget. Because I don't want to get everyone's hopes up and then... end up not doing anything that I originally planned to do. Uh... This is a terrible, terrible idea, by the way. This is a terrible... Oops, put that in pause. Oregon Trail speedruns. <laughs> oh, dear. They only have the Oregon Trail... Eh, the Oregon Trail 2 in the Twitch database, and I don't know what the difference is. I'm totally serious about this. For some... horrible reason. It's just a matter of keeping up with closing all the boxes as they pop up. Uh, no, it's not uh, that there won't be Sim Theme Park, but I just wanted to go and change the game to make it more accurate to what I'm currently doing. You guys have broken me. What's the world record? There isn't one, as far as I can tell, because no one has this version. So there's, like, no competition. I want to try to at least get one reasonably decent playthrough in here. This is probably not going to be that one. I lost three sets of clothing. Hmm. Uh, it's version 1.2, the disc is pink. 
and uh, it's got yellow writing on it in case you wanted to look for it. Oh wow. Okay, I think as long as you hold enter between landmarks it'll uh, auto-close all the buttons, which is good. I'm suffering from exhaustion, but you would never know. Yes, we need more people to race this. <laughs> that would be great. Just start a movement. Alright, so if you hold enter, have the mouse poised on the continue button, and just go. Oh, crap. Whoops. I'm not actually at the south pass. Uh, I kind of messed that one up. Is there a way to make that go back? No, there isn't. Oh well, just ignore that. Don't sink, that'd be bad. Alright, so that's good so far. And it's still kind of ahead, which is good. I think the biggest thing... whoops. Yeah, the biggest thing I'm going to overcome is not hitting the split button every time a message pops up. Because some messages that want you to actually do things um, do not go away if you hit enter. You have to manually click those. Which is my problem. What is my best time so far? Um, right under five minutes? best thing about this is that you can have so many speedruns of it, because everything is so short. Also apparently 20 seconds ahead, and now I drown. You lose, Tim. The end. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the Oregon Trail. Do I want to save? No, I don't. Alright, get rid of the party members, go doctor, go May. 20 oxen, 10 sets of clothes, 0, 1, 1, 1, 500. And... go. It was working out for a while. You're right, I probably don't need 500 pounds of food. Um, I just buy it for insurance. That probably is what makes the wagon sink, now that I think about it. Alright. You know, I used to get really aggravated when people would do speedruns and reset all the time, and now I find it's really, really easy to fall into that same exact behavior. Alright, 250 pounds of food. Let's see if that works. I don't know if I'm going any faster with less food, but the wagon weight is now light, which is good. It is less likely to tip. Also, yes, uh, this game is pretty much just entirely luck, and it hates you. That's the moral of the story. Heavy fog, apparently. Fort Kearney! Nothing there. Alright, yeah, I totally don't need 500 pounds of food then. If I've only used 30 in about 10 days. Uh, I've never heard of Mushroom Kingdom Fusion. Whatever that is. Oh. That's right. Those graves. Ah, gotta find a way to get rid of those. Are bad. Have I made it all the way to the end or have I died each time? I've made it at least once. That's pretty much all I can say at the moment. Am I going?
going to play Real Life 2007, maybe. Alright, every time you get to a landmark, you have to hold Enter, or else the uh, little bubbles will pop up. I don't actually know what you have to do to get rid of the uh, tombstones. Because the version I'm playing, I uh, ripped the files to my computer because my CD-ROM drive is really loud. And um, it isn't actually installed. I'm just running it as a standalone program. Also, I got lost, then I got better. Which... I don't know if I'm losing time or not on that. I got lost again for two days. Yeah... That was going pretty well, and now it isn't. Although, I did die last time, so... Avoid that. I have cholera. Yeah, 250 pounds of food is probably enough. Although if I make it to the end, I can know for sure what the bare minimum of food I need is. Oh. Please don't die here. That'd be horrible. Oh, no, actually. It's okay. I lost five sets of clothing, but aside from that, we're fine. In fact, it might have even been faster to sink. Not sure on that yet. 20 seconds ahead of my other record. <laughs> That's not so bad. Health is poor, but it's alright. I'm a doctor. I have a fever. I took the wrong trail. I died. <laughs> so much for that. It's going really well. I mean, I probably should have another party member in there, but uh, that increases the odds that they'll run off or get sick or die or drown. I'm not sure if this is the case, but I want to say the more stuff you have, the more things you can conceivably lose or have people that die on your wagon, the more likely it is that your wagon will sink. Not sure if that's true or not, but it makes sense to me. Because alone it doesn't seem to sink quite as much. Eh, I'm gonna go for 200 pounds of food. That might be enough. Alright. Attempt number 26. I'm ahead by a tenth of a second. Stream this for 12 hours a day for a month. Everyone would hate me. Also, I totally don't have enough food anymore because they just stole 86 pounds of it. And now I drowned. Right? Yes. <laughs> A thief stole 86 pounds of food. I didn't even have 84 pounds of food left. Also, I lost, by the way. <laughs> well, we tried. I take that back. I think you just sink no matter what. It doesn't matter how much stuff you have to uh, conceivably lose. You will still die, I guess. Oh, well. Figure out the meta game for this. I'm taking Oregon Trail to the next level. Oh, crap. Oh, well, something happened. I have typhoid apparently. Hmm. Heavy fog. Lose one day. I'm hoping I have enough food. Because I kind of lost some when the wagon tipped. And that's no good for anyone. Yep, caulking every time. Uh, 
I would. T oh crap! Yeah, it's over. I had to trade for a thing. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's kind of contingent on the wagon not breaking, or anything terribly bad happening. Um, the thing is that if you don't caulk, you have to take the ferry, and the ferry has got like a three-day wait time. Which, uh, is kind of a lot of time. So... Oh well. Time to reset again. Uh, yeah. I could probably test out how the robot plays this, see if it, uh, can get a really good time. Although, I don't think the robot closes all of the, uh, dialogue boxes as fast as I do. And I don't think it lets you hold enter. But I could try it. I didn't drown, which is promising. Uh, Oregon Bot is a uh, program that somebody made that pretty much just plays the Oregon Trail. That's it. It, it makes all the decisions, it hunts. It's... it's a robot that plays the Oregon Trail, pretty much. However, that's, uh... it's kind of cheating. I have dysentery. Go figure. Uh, somebody in the chat made it. Is this the run? I don't think so. I'm probably going to die somewhere. Again. Yeah, <laughs> right there. <laughs> I love how when you close all of the dialogue boxes immediately, you just die. Like, the messages don't pop up. You don't see it coming. You just die in the middle of the trail, and that's it. That's just how it goes. Alright, it's 11.21. Maybe I'll play until like 11.30. This is the worst thing. I don't know who suggested it, but... You've done something terrible. been at this for far too long. You've ruined my life. Yeah, pretty much. Can I put this on my resume? That'd be great. Professional organ trail player. I'm qualified, please hire me. I don't even care what the job is. I've got the skills for it. Well, nothing bad has happened so far. Which is good. Hmm. Yeah, so far, it's... It's got potential. Oh, crap. Hit the chimney rock one too early. Was not expecting to find that fruit. Oh no, I'm sure bad things will happen. I mean, it's, it's the Oregon Trail. It's pretty much a game designed to kill you in the worst way possible. Am I traveling alone? Yes. Other people on the wagon I found to be liabilities, so I'm just doing it by myself. Have to keep remembering to hit enter after every landmark. Also, my arm broke. pretty much die at any time now with a broken arm. Like right now! <laughs> Just like that. Doing it solo I don't think has ever actually gotten me to Oregon. Hmm. 
Uh, this is called W split, I believe. Like this is the first day I've ever used it. Maybe I'll buy more clothes, like 20 sets, which hopefully will make me get sick less. All right. Yeah, maybe doing it party list isn't the best idea, but in my mind it feels like it should work. Go. Any relation to X-Split? Probably not. Oh, great. Thief stole nine oxen. Gee, thanks. There goes 50% of the oxen, and now we're doomed. Oh, well. Did I lose the trail? Yeah, this is going badly. I'm just gonna get red times for everything now. Uh. Oh, well. Let's try that again. I'll bring my son along. Tim Jr. Maybe he'll die instead of me. That's why I have a kid. Oh, I need more food though. Uh, maybe 500. Apparently 4.36 is the fastest time I've gotten on this so far. Wrong trail and lost five days. And there goes the time. Oh well. Had an okay start, and that happened. I don't know what this whole Wii thing's all about. I blame Tim Jr. for that one. I wonder if you're uh, more likely to get lost with more people. Probably not. Hmm. Uh, the wagon weight is middling, yeah. That's because I had to bring twice as much food. Because there are two people instead of one person which probably makes it go slower. Well, it certainly seems like it's going slower based on the times. Plus, my son is fat. Well, that's no good. I can't have that. It's dragging us down. Okay, it is the South Pass that has that option I need to click. I need to not forget that. Tim Jr. is well again. I didn't even know he was sick. Because I'm a great father. Heavy fog. Oh well. I lost the trail. I thought I was holding down the button. Well, so much for that. I thought Tim Jr. would be a shield against all the bad stuff. But, uh... It just seems like more things are going wrong. Oops. Oh, wait, that's the reset button, not the split button. Whoops! Also, it wasn't going very well anyway. Alright, well, let's... I don't know if I should take another party member. Because it seems like more things go wrong, but at the same time, I didn't get sick and die. Tim Jr. 2. I've had another son. I think somebody sent me a tweet because they got this game and now they're trying to uh, break my time of like 4.36 or something. Tim Jr. Jr.
Tim the Third. Well, we didn't sink, which is good. No, there's certainly plenty of money. Um, we took the wrong trail and lost four days. Right in front of the landmark. Uh, Tim Jr. too was near death, but the doctor was able to help, and then he got lost. Which kinda sucks. Because I'm losing time on everything now. Yeah, I'm gonna try this with one person. I think that honestly works better. It seems to go faster and fewer bad things seem to happen. You know... What season has the fewest... negative things happening? Because maybe it isn't May. I wonder if fording a river is faster than caulking it. Uh, yeah, let's try June. Let's see what happens. One, 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 and two fifty. It's eleven thirty-one. Well, I gotta try this. Now August is way too late. Way, way too late. I'm an addict. I am. I didn't realize it would be so satisfying, even for something as... whoops, didn't mean to hit that there. Even for something as, uh... silly as this. Ignore that big blue river split. I kind of messed that up. Now I can... I used to think speedrunners were nuts. Like, who could have so much fun playing the same thing over and over and over? But now I see. And... This is probably even less interesting than any number of games people actually speedrun, because... There's really not much to do. But at the same time, it is so intensely satisfying. The best part about this game is that it requires absolutely no skill. Which is perfect for me. I also lost one pound of food. No, no cholera yet. Oh, no, I lied. There is cholera. <laughs> Whoops. Speedrunning Final Fantasy X would mean, like, at minimum, you're playing for 20 hours, I'm sure. Well, it's kind of hard to say things and read the chat and keep up with the game and look at the timer and various other things, but... I'm trying. I'm well again. I have a broken leg in the same exact day. Oh, well. Seems like the Soda Springs time will be pretty good. Oh, sort of. I hit it a little bit too early on Fort Hall. Oh well. Apparently you can speedrun Final Fantasy X in 11 hours. That sounds... kind of impressive. Like, really, really impressive. I think my Final Fantasy X playthrough took me like 40 or 50. Also, my health is very poor, so I'm probably going to die. Oh well. <laughs> what a way to go! Unless I didn't die. Oh, no I did. <laughs> That's the worst thing about this game. It's pretty much, if the game feels like killing you, it will. The end. 
Although June seemed like a viable time to leave, so... Stop doing this, I can't! I'm addicted, man. When am I going to play Sim Theme Park? I don't know! <laughs> I, I totally understand the madness of speedrunners. And there is very little to learn in this game. Just when to hold enter at the right time. Which isn't really that hard. I just want to get at least one good run in. Because I think it can be a lot faster than 436 or whatever I had before. I found some wild fruit. That's good, because now I have a lot of extra food. And I also have the measles. I'd like to think they're not related. Yeah, there is no skill involved. This is just how much patience do you have to restart the game every time you drown. I lost three pounds of food. You can't actually buy grandfather clocks in this. Which is a bit of a bummer, because if I could, I would spend all my money on that. Hey, I died! By the way. <laughs> yes! It's just like real life. Alright, kill all the party members. Go as doctor, go as June 20. 50 sets of clothing, then I'll never get sick. I hope. Although it probably makes the wagon a little bit slower. Maybe. I'm not sure if it's appreciably slow. Whoops. I didn't actually get to the Big Blue River yet. Ignore that. I'm not actually 16 seconds ahead. We will know for sure at Fort Carney. <laughs> did I die? Yes. Yes, I did. That has been the Oregon Trail, and has continued to be the Oregon Trail, again and again. What if I just put nobody in the party? What happens? What if I just dump Kate? I need a name for myself. Butts McGee. I've got faith in him. All my clothing. It's up to you, Butts McGee. Yeah, I'm, I'm fairly convinced the game just does not want to be won. And I wonder if the game decides how many bad things are going to go wrong based on what your name is. I feel like it probably doesn't, but at the same time, I can't help think that the game just has it out for me. Or at least my name. Yes, Dr. Butts McGee. That's the one. Er. An ox is sick. Oh well. The game has anti-speedrun protection. Seems like it. You know, the enter thing isn't working anymore. The windows are still popping up. Do I think a shorter name equals less weight? Oh, somehow I made up more time. I don't know how that happened. You got the Sputz McGee. This is your moment. Oh, no it isn't. You got lost. I have measles. Just watch me die. It's going to happen, I'm sure. 
Heavy fog. Again. Uh, no, I've never thought of a Minecraft speedrun. That doesn't seem like a thing. And also, I've never actually gotten to the Ender Dragon in my game, which is kind of sad. Yeah, this is not going very well. This is not going very well. I'm dead. <laughs> what if I just call myself T? I wonder if the game will take pity on me. T is the speedrun version of Tim, you know it. Oh no, I gained zero seconds. Hmm. Uh, the speedrun of the Oregon Trail in 413 you see on YouTube is for the DOS version, which runs at a different speed than this one. So you can't... oh crap. That broke. Uh, you can't directly compare them, I don't think. Well, I found an abandoned wagon containing 25 bolts, two wagon wheels, one wagon axle, and one wagon tongue. And fruit. And fog. And fruit. Apparently there are also fewer things to click in the DOS version. I have no idea. I've never played it. Oh, great. I hit that the wrong time. No, this isn't going very well. Um, an ox is sick. Too many bad things are happening, and I'm kind of way over time on this. And I died, apparently. The game takes mercy on me and kills me when it isn't going very well. Um... The best... I got this. Alright. Let's do this. That's my new skill. My new strategy. time. It's like 4.36 or something. I don't know if I need that much clothing, to be honest. Because I think it might slow down the wagon. Also, I wonder if this game runs any faster if you have a faster computer. Probably not. I would guess. But you never know. I am a really incompetent doctor. Well, the thing is that I need doctors to heal me when I get sick. And there aren't any. So I just die. I die of loneliness. Uh, I don't think a different class is worth it because, um... You tend to not die as much as a doctor. Although, I don't know if that means that other party members don't die or if you are also less likely to die. Because if that is the case, my arm broke by the way, so I'm probably gonna die any minute now. Um, if it only works on other party members in keeping up the health and not on yourself, I could pick a party that has the ability to fix things like wagon things breaking or oxen dying, which would prevent the number of bad things that can conceivably happen. I died, <laughs> by the way. <laughs> um, that was going pretty well, too. Bummer. Um... Hmm... 
because you need more than 400 bucks at least to buy 20 oxen and some food. And I feel like the doctor's advantage is probably the important one, because I don't think these two really play in that much. Also, your health goes down really fast when you are on grueling pace, but it's kind of the only way to make a good time, I think. Why did I die? I don't know. It's the Oregon Trail. It doesn't need a reason. It just kind of happens. That's life. I can't believe I'm still doing this, by the way. This death is always on my heels. That's the Oregon Trail for you. It's the one game that makes you wish... You were actually just... Oh, I don't know. I had something insightful to say there, and then I totally forgot it. Normally you play video games for escapism. You know, to forget about real life. Well, this is the one game that makes you just want to live your life, because it is so much better than what happens on the screen. Broken axle. Can I fix it? Yes. Although it's still slowing it all down. No. It's not good. Speedrun Sim Theme Park. Oh man. I have not played Sim Theme Park in about a decade, and I've been meaning to play it on this stream, but I'm entirely too addicted to this. Which is kind of sad. It started off as an offhand joke might be the thing that consumes my entire evening. Uh, Mr. Woodchuck, if you have an Android phone, uh, somebody in the chat has actually made an app that is a soundboard for this game. So, you might be in luck if you want all of these sounds on your phone. Although I don't have the link to that at the moment. If the person who made it is watching, maybe he can spot you that. Local man often die or local man dies from Oregon Trail addiction. Sounds about right. If I can get under 4 minutes 30 seconds, I would consider that pretty good. Alright, here is the Snake River where I am most likely to die if it's going to happen at all. Don't drown here. That'd be bad. It's going so well. Okay, we're good. It survived. The day is saved. Health is poor bad water. Health is very poor. No grass. Hmm. And 20 seconds for Fort Boise. I don't know, it might happen. My health is kind of uh, worrying me a bit. Bad water three times in a row means I'm dead. <laughs> well, it looked okay. It certainly seemed like it could have been under 430. But nope, I died. Again. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. It seemed so good. But, it wasn't. Ever gonna play Sim Theme Park? I don't know. This is more entertaining for me than I thought it would be. Not sure about what it is for people watching, though. Crap. 
Gee, did I die? Oh, no, I didn't. I lost one wagon wheel. And apparently sinking saves a bit of time. Which is good to know. As long as you don't die while sinking, I guess. That is the qualifier on that. I've never played Sim Safari. I've never even heard of Sim Safari. But it seems like there is probably a game out there if it begins with Sim something or something tycoon. No matter what, there is probably a game related to anything with one of those titles. If you check the recordings of this later on, you'll probably be able to find the guy who recommended this idea to me in the first place. I don't think anyone gets addicted to the Oregon Trail... UNTIL TODAY! Sim Brothel, I bet. That would not surprise me. I have, like, Gentleman's Club Tycoon. Fog. I die. <laughs> Why? What did I die of? It just happens. No matter what you do, you just kind of die. 20. How about no sets of clothing? Maybe I need to be naked. I'm so much more aerodynamic now. Stop playing this. <laughs> Some horrible addiction. Oh. Everyone in your party has died, which is just one person, really. Tim, 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 T. So going without clothes may or may not be related to drowning. I'll just bring, bring 25 pairs of pants just to be safe. I don't know if I did better with the party. I made it farther with the party, but the times weren't as good. Which is the difference. I feel like as long as I don't die for some stupid reason alone, the time will probably be better. Brown, okay. Go, go, go. It's all random, so there has to be at least a small chance of me making it there without a party. Because if you have a party, there's more chance of people getting sick, people dying, or people getting lost for like nine days. I got bitten by a snake, by the way. Which, uh, increases the odds you'll probably stop from something stupid. from snake bite. I still have wild fruit. I found the bandwagon, got lost, and had my food spoil all in one day. Bummer. Oh, I'm well again. Woohoo! And I'm one second ahead, apparently. Pro mashing strats. You know it. What did I do? Oh. Cocked it. Don't sink, don't sink. Yes! We're good, we're good. I 
Alright, I think we're okay. As long as I don't die. Whoever said run number 42 might be the one. Might have been spot on with that. I hope. <laughs> I really hope. Oh wait, I forgot to hit the thing on Fort Hall. Whoopsies. Come on, Snake River. Don't drown here. Okay. Don't die. I have a broken arm, no! If you break any part of your body, the game can just kill you at any time. Oh. Please, don't die. Don't die. Don't. Die. I could make it maybe sub four minutes. Come on. No, don't go to Fort Walla Walla, no. <laughs> no, don't go here. I don't need to go here. Oh no. I haven't even made it to the Dalles yet. I hit the thing prematurely because I went to the wrong place. Alright, ignore that. Come on. Just go the next hundred miles. Come on, come on. Make it, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it! No, what?! <laughs> Are you kidding?! The hell did I do?! <laughs> Jesus, God. <laughs> Welcome to the Oregon Trail, where every dream you've ever had at success is... is dashed at the last minute. I, I don't have anything to say to that. I, I was literally, like, right there, right at four minutes, and I died. <laughs> uh. But now I know that getting it under four minutes is actually possible. Oh, don't rest. Ah, already screwed that one up. <laughs> I can't believe that happened. Can't believe I died right there. Oops, I need clothes. I just can't stop playing it, especially now. Given what just happened. Yes, if I didn't go to Walla Walla, I probably would not have died. Which is a terrible thought, because the only reason I lost is because I did a stupid thing. Oh man, oh jeez. <laughs> Am I dead? Yes. I'm dead. <laughs> At least when you die, you don't really waste a whole lot of time. Because it's not a very long game. Oh, whoops, I forgot to hit the thing. I'm still going, but my spirit's been crushed, pretty much. Don't sink. I don't need this. I don't know... there's like no precedent for Oregon Trail speedruns, so I don't know when you're supposed to hit 
start because, to the best of my knowledge, no one has actually had a complete run of this up anywhere. And there's a reason for that, because it's a dumb thing to do. Which is why I'm the one doing it. But soon it'll take off, and everyone will put down their Wind Waker and Super Mario and take up the Oregon Trail. Right? Right. I'm literally the best player in the world at this. Oh yeah, it's something to be proud of. Also, yes, I've been doing this for about... I don't know, two and a half hours. It's kind of more just a parody of speedruns, to be honest, but... It's taken on a life of its own, and I can't stop playing. Although, I'm barely paying attention to this, and it's apparently doing reasonably well. A lot of green up on that. Look, if I actually get this under four minutes or so, I will submit it to every speedrun site. Mostly as a joke, but also because... I'm totally proud of it. I don't know if I'm sick, though, or if my leg is broken. Because I could die, and that would be bad. Although I'm almost 30 seconds ahead, so that's pretty good. Just don't sink at the Snake River Crossing, and we'll be okay. Alright, we might be fine. My leg broke, by the way. Good job, Brack the Man, you totally called it, and now I'm going to die. My spirit and my leg are broken. Both of them. At once. Also, my other leg broke, apparently. And my wagon tongue broke. Now it's fixed. Now a thief stole 11 sets of clothes. I found fruit. Alright. Well, a bunch of bad things have happened, but there is still hope. Oh, I broke two legs and my arm. And then I died. I died. <laughs> I was like 40 seconds ahead. 75% of my limbs are broken. And then I die. Couldn't even break my other arm. It just cuts me off right there. It was obviously not meant to be. Pace, scroll and go. Not everyone makes it to Oregon. I love how the game tries to console you at the end. How many games do you know that have consolation messages in it? Like, it's okay, everyone dies. This is the only game I know that's like that. Uh, my shoes are brown, I got to the end about 30 seconds ahead and then died at the last minute and almost got under 4 minutes. But I died on literally the last day. Also, I have dysentery. Which means I'm going to die. Hmm. I found fruit. I have a broken leg. And dysentery. That means I'm going to die. Maybe? Maybe it's the good dysentery. You know, you might be right. Maybe it is. I thought Sim Theme Park 2 and then this happened. time, at least, at least it generally has the, um, the consideration to only make me waste a minute or so in having to restart. Whoops, I need more than one pounds of food. Broken legs build character. You're right. <laughs> a 
I'm sorry about the uh, Sim Theme Park. I don't know what happened. Oh, I died. 20 seconds in, I'm dead. Alright, no party members. Dr. May 2025 Exactly, and go. I lasted a full 20 seconds. Think about it. That's progress. I don't know when time is supposed to start, because there is no precedent for this. So I'm just hitting it on go. I kinda consider stocking out your wagon and putting in party names and everything, like naming a file on a game or something, you know, it's it's about how fast you play the game, not how fast you can type. Again, there's like no record of this anywhere to compare it to, so who knows. Also, yeah, your main guy can't die unless all your party members have died. But if you have party members, you run the risk of them getting lost or something and slowing down the uh, trip to Oregon. So it is a big trade-off, and it's, um... I've been doing it without people, because uh, it seems to go faster that way. But at the same time, I die all the time. Which pretty much brings all of these to a crashing halt no matter how well they seem to be going at the time. Is this game rated M? You would think so, given all of the death that happens. But, um... You know, I don't actually know what the rating of, the rating of this game is. I've got the case here somewhere. I'll check it out. It's probably... everyone, if I had to guess. Or, for all I know, it came out before the rating system. Hey, I died! Just drop dead. So much for that. Party members... Alright, let me put in one more guy. Tim Jr. Doctor, alright. Leave in May. 250111. And how about 350? Maybe that's enough for two people. I can't have more than 20 ox. Oh, sorry. Oh, ignore that. Alright, I've got one more guy with me. Hopefully he'll get sick and die way before I do. Well, we didn't drown, which is good. Gotta keep him alive to take the dysentery bullet for me. I said I'd stop at 11.30, it's currently 12.07. And I'm still playing. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just really want to get at least one good time in there. I should just do this professionally. Yeah, that'll be my job. I'll just drop out of college. You know, what am I going to get with a bio degree? Clearly, not as much as this game could conceivably give me in life. I'm fairly sure wagon weight does make a difference in how fast you move. Because I loaded it up with 2,000 pounds before, and it took a bit longer to get to Kansas River. Or the Kansas River. Play ads every reset. Oh god, that'd be terrible. You'd have the ads lasting longer than the actual playthroughs. Oh, I didn't actually get to South Pass. Oh well. I have an Oregon Trail clan. I wish. Go, don't sink. Don't s oh, damn it. Oh. Sinking actually takes you across the river faster than uh, crossing it through normal means. Except it has the unintended side effect of killing you, which is. Not very good. Uh, I'll just do it one person this time. Why 
Why doctor? Uh, because you don't get as sick as the other classes. So, if you stay on grueling pace, you don't die in like the first week. Which is generally what happens for other classes. Kid needs an intervention? I probably do. Oh, whoops. Forgot to hit that. Ah, just mash the keyboard. Oh man. Going to be here all day, all night. I had a giant cup of coffee before this. There's nothing stopping me. <laughs> Go! No! I'm way behind. Take a shot every time I die. Oh god, please don't. I'd be responsible for so many deaths. More so than this game could ever hope to accomplish. Let's try to only have this game kill uh, people in the game and not people in real life. That would be terrible. Apparently Oregon Trail 2 is now the 18th most watched game on Twitch. We did it, guys. We've started a revolution. It's a movement. Except all of the times for this aren't very good. I think I've got a better chance at doing this under four minutes than I do with having the merry-go-round explode. But that is just me. I was bitten by a snake, by the way. Which means I'm going to die right about now. Heavy fog. Huh. I don't know how I've messed up this badly, to be honest. I don't know what I could have done. It seemed alright. Oh. Huh. It seemed alright! I died, but before that... Ugh. Alright, Wikipedia. Give me a name. Tim is not cutting it. Oh, that's not a dude. That's not a dude. Ben Cronin. I don't know who you are, but welcome aboard. All of my hope lays with you. Uh, we could do teams, but the issue is that you have more people in the party, which kind of slows it down. Don't sink, don't sink, don't sink, don't sink, damn it! No one die, no one die, no one die, no one die! Alright, fine. Lost one wagon axle, big deal. We lost a stick. But that's okay, because we made up the time by sinking. We should sink more often. I'm being totally serious about that. Yeah, Ben can swim. He's uh, doing a pretty bang-up job so far. Oh, great. Oh, the wagon broke. But somehow it is still okay, so... For that, I am thankful. This game is a drug. It's a mix of clicks and banging on the enter button some message boxes you have to click and some go away with enter. So I just do both. Cover all my bases. I'm suffering from exhaustion. Come on, Ben. 
don't die. Don't die here. This is up to you. The hope of an entire people lies on your shoulders. Good job, Ben. You blew it. Uh, you know, let's do something dumb. Let's go in July. I've never done it that way before. Maybe it will work better. It probably won't, by the way. But you never know. Am I hitting the splits, or does the game know? Nope, that's me. Very hot. Maybe that means we won't sink. That doesn't actually mean that, but it would be nice. Well, so far, so good. 30 seconds in. That's about 12.5% of the run right there. Damn it, Groose. I had a party that I filled up entirely with Grooses, and we got to one river, the thing sunk, and all the Groose died at once. It's a massive... death Groose... Groose death thing. All the grease, yes. That is what I meant. Well, if you search high enough in my uh, Twitter profile, it's probably still there. Also, I broke my leg, which means the game can kill me at any time, whenever it fancies it. Oops, a little bit early on that. Please don't die, please don't die, please don't die. That would be horrible. On. There's also a certain spot you should have your mouse where you can hit all of the prompts that come up at once without having to move. And it's right about here, I think. Don't sink? Okay! That's not so bad. My arm is still broken, but as long as I don't die, we are en route for... Uh, reasonably decent time. I hope. Hmm. Trying to get below four minutes. If I can do that, that would be great. I don't know. July seems to be working out pretty well. I'm not sure if it's just coincidence or what. But, uh, I haven't died yet. He says as he dies the next day. Huh? No? Okay. Still in business. As long as we don't sink. Glug, glug. Oh, no. We're good. We're still good. Alright. Fort Boise is where we have to make up all the time. Because I think the fastest run I had here got us stuck here for ten days. Come on. Go. Health is very poor, I don't care. I'm well again, yes. <laughs> there's still a chance. I'm suffering from exhaustion, no, there's no chance. <laughs> Damn it. It was going so well. So. Well. <laughs> Ugh. I'll do another one in July. I do have a problem. I definitely do, I, I totally admit it. But, uh... The key to giving up any addiction is wanting to stop, and at the moment, I don't. Is 
start taking names from the chat. Alright, why not? Next time, I have a broken arm and cholera at the same time. I'm gonna be up all night doing this. Just you wait. Is there a group session for Oregon Trail Addicts? I wish. I should lead it. Fort Laramie. Okay. I can make the names, the colors as well. Whatever you guys want. I don't really mind. I mean, I would just put Tim in otherwise. Uh, the names for your player in the party. No water, apparently. Oh, the times are not very good here. Go, go, go. Don't sink, don't sink. It sunk. Didn't sink. Alright. That works. Yes, we've played a game for far, far too long. The next logical thing to do is to speedrun it, I guess. Even if it is something like the Oregon Trail. I wonder what the speedrun of Solitaire is like. Let's do some speedrunning for Microsoft 3D Pinball. Slightly ahead. I found some wild fruit. Woohoo. Am I sick or am I okay? I took the wrong trail and lost five days. Ah! I was so far ahead. Now I'm not. Speedrun chess. Oh yeah! Pull out that three-move mate. Uh, bad water, and it got lost. Hmm. I don't think this is going to be under four minutes, assuming I actually make it to the end. Alright, it's the Grand Ron where I have to, uh... I have the measles. It's the Grand Ronde where I have to make the choice to take the toll road and not raft. Oh no, wait, this is the one where I have to make the decision to not go to Fort Walla Walla. Which is the bottom one, okay. Speed run your taxes. I'm sure everyone would love to watch that. Uh, not four minutes. I died. <laughs> nope. Oh well, I did die. Um, red. Okay, everyone with a red name in the chat, that's you. This is your time to shine. You can change your name in the chat, by the way, to something that is red. Oh, whoops. Forgot to hit that. Oh, jeez, I forgot to hit it in the beginning. Ah. I gotta start that over. Forgot to hit the timer. It'll still be red, don't worry. Alright, July, 20 oxen, 25 sets of clothing. I don't actually know if that's any better or worse than more or less clothes. Got to do it again. Woohoo. Okay, travel. Okay. Red. Get rid of these guys. Get the doctor. July. 20 oxen. 25 sets of clothing. 0, 1, 1, 1, 2, 50. Go. Okay, there we go. And we're off. I was wondering how I was, uh, like, 8 seconds ahead on the Kansas River. It's because I forgot to hit the button.
Go, 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 go. Well, it's going okay. So far. Health is... oh. I was gonna say health is good, but it isn't anymore. Now it is just plain old fair. Hmm. Heavy fog, oh. Bummer. Beginner's luck, I hope not. This game just kind of kills you eventually, even if you're doing really well in the beginning. It has a way to just screw everything up at the very last minute. I still really want to get below four minutes, though. That will be my goal. I also promised I would stop doing this about an hour ago. Who is my favorite color team? I don't have a favorite color team, but out of the colors that I pick four teams, I would have to say red is my favorite. Nothing about the people who are on red, I just like that color. This could be a good gambling game. Totally could. No skill involved, only luck. I'm suffering from exhaustion. I'm dead. No, I'm not dead. Not dead yet, anyway. Please don't die. Come on. Go! A fire in my wagon. We ran so fast. There was so much friction between the wagon and the dirt that it caught fire. Also, we're going to run out of food at this rate. Come on, don't sink. Red has a broken leg. Oh well. Too bad. Just take the leg off. We don't have any space for dead weight. This could be less than four minutes if I don't die. Please don't die. Come on. Go. Very poor health, broken leg. Come on, don't die. No, I picked the <laughs> If I picked the toll road, it would have won. Ah, uh, <laughs> no. Ah. Uh. <laughs> oh, so much wasted time. Okay, the top one is the toll road. I thought it was the bottom. Look at how far ahead it was. <laughs> so it's under 4.30, but it isn't under 4 minutes. In fact, that might not have... Is it under 4.30? Oh, that's the reset button. That's not the split button. Well, it was about 4.30. Ignore that. Alright, let's try Team Blue this time. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. I deleted all the splits. Oh well. Not intentional, believe me, it just sort of happened that way. Heavy fog. That's no good. I 
think the best place to put your cursor on this to make sure you hit all the dialogues that pop up that you can't close with Enter is, like, right here, below the N and the U, or between them, and on the border of the button. Seems to be the best place to go there. This is also attempt number 57. <laughs> Why I'm still playing, I have no idea, but I can't bring myself to stop. That could have been under four minutes if I only picked the right place at the end. Ignore the grave. If you stop and watch the grave, you will go and die yourself. I'm sure that's how this works. Well, Blue is doing okay so far. I will grant you that. And we're about seven seconds ahead. Uh, Klopp is, uh... Queued up B U O P with horses. I died. <laughs> By the way. Uh, green. Alright, everyone green in the chat, this is your moment. How about 249 pounds of food? That extra pound will make sure we have enough speed to make it. so much more aerodynamic now. An ox wandered off for one day. That might have just ruined it. Think of the children, I'm trying. the world record for this game, there isn't one. Oh, great. Um, as far as I can tell, there isn't one at the moment. Somebody has a record of 4.16 for the DOS version, but that runs at a slightly different speed. Um, and I could have gotten it under four minutes if I didn't make the wrong decision at the very last waypoint. The most accurate, most recent record we've had so far is right about 4.30. I- <laughs> God. I also just died. Just randomly. So now it's Team Pink. July 20... 25... 0... You know, we're gonna do it with no spare parts. means this game has less text to render, so maybe it goes faster. It probably doesn't. Oh, forgot to hit start. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. Ignore that. 20, 25, 0, 0, 0, 0, 250. This is any faster with fewer parts. Eh, not really. Didn't sink though, so we're good. Why not 50 clothes? Uh, it's extra weight. I'm not sure how much of a difference it makes, but if I'm willing to jettison spare parts, I'm not willing to take on more weight in clothes. Because the thing is that if the wagon breaks, if anything on the wagon breaks, that's it. It's over. Um, I would have to trade, and that would take too much time. The spare parts are only really a precaution. But, um... You know, we'll see what happens if we don't have them. Hopefully 
hopefully nothing too bad, because so far, it's uh, doing alright on times without the parts. I don't know if that's a function of there being less weight or just being lucky. I was bitten by a snake. You know, by the way. Just sharing. Sig's chat also has like 20 times as many people. I took the wrong trail and lost five days. And then I died. The end. Alright, let's... let me change this up. What if I do this? Get rid of the party members because they're just dead weight. What if I do this? And take that person's advice. 20 oxen, 50 sets of clothes so we never get sick, no parts, and 250 pounds of food. I'm curious. Willing to try anything at this point. Does this make it go appreciably slower? Not really, so far. So it still might be okay. But if the wagon breaks, the run is pretty much over because we don't have any parts. So no, um, extra clothes do not make it go slower. In case you were wondering. How am I making the splits? Uh, I'm just hitting the button really fast. It's, uh, the right arrow key. Yes! 61st attempt. To be fair, most of them are less than one minute. And, like, no longer than four. I have a broken arm, by the way. It's just kind of dangling there. can't stop attending, er, attending, attempting. I have to do it, have to get under four minutes. Oh. <laughs> also, I died. Apparently, I can't get sick with 50 sets of clothes, but I can get bitten by a snake. How the snake bites through all 50 layers is beyond me, but uh, apparently it's a thing that can happen. Uh, the program in the top right corner is called WSplit, and you load it with things that you want it to have, and it just times them for you. I'm kind of hoping that it sinks, because sinking and getting across the river is faster than just legitimately getting across the river. As long as no one dies, there's really nothing to be lost like that. Uh, yes, if you leave all the other player slots blank, no one else comes along. Which is good, because then you don't have to worry about them getting lost. And so far, it seems to be doing okay lost a day due to heavy fog. But we should still be on target. Do 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 do. That's pretty good. About four seconds ahead. Just need to get under four minutes and I will consider myself accomplished for the day. Five and a half seconds ahead. And nothing really bad has gone wrong so far. I mean, I'm sure something terrible is going to happen. And like, nuclear holocaust broke out. But so far, it's been pretty uneventful. Oh, I took the wrong trail and lost four days. Whoops. Uh, got a little bit too overexcited on that one split and made it way too early. Should still be okay, though, in terms of time. I have cholera. Bummer.
Please don't die. Please don't die. Oh man, I should... <laughs> I should reach into my drawer of horrible old educational games. Do a speedrun of Math Blaster. That would be the worst. I'm not that good at math. Even if it is just like, what is 4 plus 5? Speed run, jump start, Spanish. Also, I sunk. Hopefully I didn't die. Oh no, I didn't. So I actually made up time that way. Which is actually really, really good for the, uh... For the run so far. By sinking and not dying. Alright, let's not screw this up. Pick the bottom option. Okay, now I have to pick the top option. And then I I might actually make it under four minutes. Just don't die. At the Dalles, pick the top. Pick the top. Pick the top. Pick the top. Okay. Oh, wait, I hit too fast. <laughs> oh, no. Derm. <laughs> I screwed it up. I screwed it up, but I... <laughs> Is anyone keeping track? No. It wasn't that short, because I hit the other split way too fast. That was under four, but I don't know what time it was. So... <laughs> uh, I've got the crappiest score. I can't believe I did that. Well, it's totally possible. Just time it from the video. No, gotta do it live. Their Oregon Trail and Adrenaline should not go together. They really, really shouldn't. Oops, I forgot to hit start. They really, really shouldn't. <laughs> Okay, 20, 50, 0, 0, 0, 250. I did not do that on purpose, believe me. I need to do it all in one full thing without uh, having to consult the recording. Can I go for sub 330? I probably could if I don't get lost for like a week. Also, apparently having 50 clothes means you never die. No one cares anymore. I don't know. I care. Sort of. I can't believe I did that. Two reasonably decent runs, and I uh, screwed him up due to personal error. Some Korean kid's going to beat me in the morning? Hmm. Well, I can't have that. I did say under four minutes. just playing this over and over. I'm gonna have this music burned into my brain. In fact, it's probably already there. I'm going to have horrible flashbacks Oops. to this moment. Oops. I hit that one too early. I'm not 21 seconds ahead. That would be nice. I just want one official thing. Just one nice, clean, easy screen cap. But I can just say, look, this is what it is. We're done, but that 
doesn't seem to be the case. Because I botched it. I will never be the same again. No, I'm a broken man. Too tough to cry. Did they accept, uh, speedrun videos with, like, the chat on top of it and random commentary and other junk? Don't sink. Okay, cool. Yes. Okay, that works. Hey, this is going reasonably well. Except I got the measles and the broken arm at the same time. And then I died. <laughs> well, it's no longer going pretty well. Tim! Da -da -da -da. Doctor, yes, please, July. Okay, 20 oxen, 50 sets of clothing, nothing else except for food. It is a children's game from 1993, I think. Maybe 1995. As a kid, my goal was to get to Oregon, however long that took. As a 20-year-old college student, my goal is to get to Oregon in under four minutes. Instead of any other number of things I could conceivably have done. Whoops, I put that at the wrong place. Speedrun number munchers. You know, I've probably been playing Oh, whoops, I just got randomly distracted. Uh, I've probably been playing this for about three hours, just straight up. I saved the split where I split early, I will never beat them. Oh, did I? Oh, yeah, you're right. I totally did. Whoops. I think I saved it, though. Uh, wherever it is. Date modified. Do do do. This one. There we go. That's the really, really old one, but good enough. All right. Uh, <laughs> I was gonna make another promise to uh, say I would move on to another game, but I don't think I have enough self-control to actually follow through with that. I don't think I could promise anything. <laughs> Just move on. Just turn it off. No one wants to watch this anymore. It is the speedrunner's high. It is a thing. It is a legitimate, actual thing. Even for something as stupid as this. Everyone wants to see more. I don't think that's the case. I just really want to get below that time and have it on with accurate timing. Everyone boycott. No, don't do that. I see a grave by the trail. I broke the wagon tongue. Oh, wait. That's right, I didn't buy any extra pieces. Mm. Alright. I'll make a promise. I will move on to something else in... 12 minutes. It is 12.48. Once it gets to 1 a.m., it'll kill me inside, but I'll pop in something else instead. I don't actually own the Amazon trail, so it's a bit of an issue there. Just gotta be good at video games. <laughs> oh, great. 
Am I dead? No, I'm not. I just lost all my food. And we had a storm. And a wagon. At the same time. Or not, not the wagon. Um, a storm and a fire in the wagon. Yeah, I lost about 50% of my clothes in that wagon fire. I found some fruit, and heavy fog, and heavy cholera, apparently. I lost all of my pants, yes, every single pair of pant. They're all gone. Must make sub four minutes with the little timer thing actually saying that. I am well again, and heavy fog. Ah, uh, dysentery. I'm dead. I can't stop to hunt because I have no bullets. Which is why I'm dead. <laughs> oh well. Doctor, okay. July, okay. 20, 50, 0, 0, 0, 250. 251. found fruit. <laughs> this is pretty much just the entire game at this point. Everything just goes wrong. It's just a game of broken promises and unfulfilled dreams. Everyone watch me. Everyone watch my stream of me watching Tim's stream and raging. Are you not, uh, inspired? Does this not make you feel better about the world and every... Uh, I don't know. I just really feel like I have to get this done at least once without screwing up. Apparently I have to ban somebody, but I can't take my fingers off the keyboard. Hmm. This is why mods are good, probably. What are they linking in there? It's a virus and porn spam. Oh. I like how it's both porn and spam. Uh. It's a screamo flash. Oh, that put the game on pause. Here, Homer, I go for it. Have fun. You take care of it. Um. There. <laughs> Had to abort that one. Just pick some random dude. Twenty, fifty, one hundred, no, zero. Yes, now I have a mod, and the police state can begin. I've just kind of found the general rule is to not click any link in any chat room. Apparently the mod is inactive. Well, I... Hmm. Ah. There. 
Now you're banned. Happy now! Had to abandon that. But justice has finally been served. Mod Pyro. Okay, here you go. I could just turn links off, to be honest. 20, 50, 0, 0. There. It happened. Now we can all watch the Oregon Trail in peace. Free from porn and or screamers and or whatever that link was. Make everyone a mod. Yes, that can't go horribly wrong. I just modded Evil Homer because he was on the chat window at the moment. I didn't go through the user list or anything, I just picked him because he was there. Pretty much. Go, wagon, go! We don't really need that many mods, to be perfectly honest. Just that one link that kept getting posted around. Independence Rock, on time. For the kids. Yes, Jason, you can be a mod if you run a successful smear campaign. I took the wrong trail and lost four days. Well, that's no good. Oh no, my advantage. Hmm. Hoping that, uh, four days spent getting lost didn't sink this. I mean, it seems still sort of doable, kind of, as long as nothing horrible happens. It might be okay. I have a broken arm, by the way. Probably gonna die. Or will I? It is not 1 a.m., it is 12.57. Go, go, go. This might be it. At least the only one I can get recorded. Less than a minute to go. An ox is sick. I don't care as long as I don't die. I can just call it. I have a broken leg. That's fine. Just keep going. I don't care about the broken leg. Just one more stop. <laughs> one more stop! Don't die between now and there. Oh, god damn it! <laughs> Are you kidding? Oh! Hate this game! <laughs> well, there's time for one more. Zero oxen. I suppose having zero oxen would be a bit of an issue. Oh, I said the thing too fast. Hang on. 7.59, as long as I can start this run before 1 o'clock, I consider it still valid. Or 12.59, not 7.59. There, we're good.
Glug, glug. It's still 12.59 here, as long as I don't die, it keeps going, okay, lost 38 sets of clothes. That's fine. I was not in those clothes at the time. Go, 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 don't sink, okay, keep going. What? <laughs> It just happened. <sighs> oh man. What do I even do now? It's one o'clock. I don't even want to play anything else. That's the worst part. <laughs> I did promise. Um. All right. I I have one idea. What? What I was gonna say is, I could load up the other run that I had before, like, I could load up the recording and put the timer next to it, and then just make accurate timers as I go through it, or accurate splits. But, um... Oh well. <laughs> that would probably be... something. Uh, but that would be pretty much just... more Oregon Trail, which people might not want to see anymore. I don't know why, but, oh well. So, I promised at one o'clock I would move on to uh, Sim Theme Park, and uh, I could. My only concern is that the viewer total went way up, much higher than it normally goes, and would you guys mind? Uh, some Sim theme park, which I haven't played in about 10 years. Uh, I've never played Spore, I haven't even installed it, and it's still sitting in my desk that, uh, somebody dropped off here. Uh, what did I even ask? Did I ask for a Sim theme park? Did I ask for the Oregon Trail? I've forgotten. Yes, Sim theme park. Do it, do it. Yes, please. You should play Spore one day. Theme park, please do. Finally. Alright, well, I will give Sim Theme Park a little go, I guess. Let's do it to appease everyone. That's what it seems like. I was on the verge of victory. Except for those hundred or so failed runs. Okay, so Sim Theme Park, again, haven't played it in the longest time. I'm just gonna stick them. Yeah can't talk. I'm just going to stick this in the corner for safekeeping when I eventually get tired of Sim Theme Park in about five minutes and move on to the Oregon Trail. Cough, cough. Whoops, there goes the chat. Here's still Ben Cronin, the guy that we filled out the party thing for that one time. There we go. 